Hey there, everybody, and welcome back to some Mind Over Magic. I do apologize for the delay on this video. My wife and I, we were on vacation this past weekend, and we got back, and we were extremely tired from all the driving. So I've kind of been behind on my recording, but, you know, that's okay. I'm going to get these out as soon as I can. Uh, so with Mind Over Magic, uh, I am going to probably go and slow down the release. I think I mentioned that in the last video as well. Um, we'll probably start covering maybe one or two episodes every new patch. I'm going to do a third one for this uh, patch with the helpers that we recently made in the uh, Atelier. Because uh, I just want to show them off some more. We have them kind of going around doing their thing. We have a handyman. Uh, we have, I think I saw that we had some woodworkers over here. Uh, so yeah, I would just want to go ahead and cover a lot of these. You can see them going. Uh, there's a harvester, so they're just harvesting what they can. Um, so I'm going to cover some more of that. And then uh, we're gonna, going to probably, like I said, slow it on the release. I think the next update they're going to work on is the dragon update, whichever that means. You can see this guy putting a scarecrow in there. Nice. Um, so a couple different things I want to work on is that I want to work on some storage. I want to work on getting some more snow, uh, smoke sticks because we need to get another uh, weaver bird in here so that we can produce more scrolls. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and get some more smoke stick planters wherever they're at. There they are. And I'm going to put them in this little corner right here. I just noticed that when I actually made this little section of the garden, um, I kind of cut it off with this guy, but that's kind of okay because we can kind of just make a maze. Um, of different pathways to get to the garden and we have our new harvesters doing their job. They're really cool I really like these guys. Uh, they seem to help a good bit. I'm glad they are added to the game So next thing is storage. I need to work on getting bigger storage. And so what do we do for that? Well, we're gonna do some research And I believe to get the bigger storage we're gonna need to get some scrolls Because uh, the patron of the arts uh, you need to go over here and get that on um, my think I want to work on that next, or I either want to work on getting maybe some of this um, nature teaching. Uh, we kind of lean heavily into the nature and the, the earth type teaching. Um, we have, I believe, what we need to up. No, we already have our kitchen upgraded. That's good. I'm not going to work towards the dark arts at the moment. Uh, we could work on getting the water one done, but that requires potions. Not really heavily looking to potions just yet. Uh, better cooking would be good. So probably better cooking and better, let's see here, better storage would be best. So we need a lot more scrolls, which means we need to get this handled. So bigger storage is going to come from that, which means we need their battle or get the process of getting this uh, scriven, scriv, scrivenry set up. There we go. Words are difficult, which means we need thorn to wait, wait, we need thorn tooths. Oh, yeah, we have to get Thorn Tooth, and I'm not entirely sure how we reliably get those guys. Um, we need to repel the fog, I know that, which means we need a bunch of Honey Drop and a bunch of Spore Cap. And I'm noticing it takes a good bit to do that, so we may want to wait for the fog to come a little closer for us to do that. Which I think we will do. Uh, we want to work on getting Scarecrows as well. We do have where we can make meat now, which I do think both of our... Yep, we are working on making meat, which means we can make the Scarecrow in now. So let's look at our garden, and let's get the Scarecrow out here. So we can put a Scarecrow, and it covers a good chunk of area here. So we could go ahead and put probably one here and one uh, put one on the edge, I think. So we want to cut some of this stuff down. Uh, we'll just destroy the manager. Actually, we can harvest it. That's a better option. That's more frugal. Uh, so I think for these trees, I'm going to say, hey, prioritize these. Um just so we get them down and uh, I can go ahead and start putting the scarecrow scarecrow down so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a scarecrow here uh, we probably can take some of these out I don't know if I'm gonna actually do this idea here um, I know I had some idea going there don't know if it's actually gonna work or not uh, so we can see our harvester going getting to work and it does prioritize which is good and then we put a scarecrow here and then kind of build out this way with our garden uh, and this now that I think about it we don't we're not gonna need bitter rice on that much we could do some more honey drop. Put some more honey drop out here, which it may grow better. Um, would not hurt to put, you know, honey drop along the gardens here uh, so that we can uh, have more uh, to go around. Uh, bitter rice may be used in other meals, so we can leave it. Uh, so once I get all this cut down, uh, then we will handle that. So I'm going to speed up time a little bit. Go ahead and let that run uh, i also want to go ahead and try to make these extra bet these rooms up here these have been here for several episodes and we haven't done anything with it and i think it's time to change that because we have plenty of stuff to do that now they have a massive bed here now oh that is a huge bed um which way does that go is that is that is that the way okay so the pillow's there 
That's the back. I think. Is that right? No, that's not right. That's right. Okay, that's what we want. Um, yeah, this room is kind of small for this bed, isn't it? Uh, I think I might actually do the bed like this. Okay, so what do we need for their private bedrooms? So let's go ahead and get these bedrooms done. So for our teacher private bedrooms, we need, wherever it may be, this is a bed chamber, I believe. So it's private, lofted, and elevated. And then we need exactly one canopy bed, exactly one door, and 60 or greater luxury. Um, okay, so let's try to get the luxury built out in here. Uh, we don't have any fiber textile, which is fine. Uh, we can do a hallway runner, just because why not? We can add eventually some of these rugs, which add 16 to it. So we'll have to do that at some point. I don't know if I have enough room for this. Granted, I can use a stained glass window, which adds 10 luxury, so we can do that. So I think I'll add that there. Or up here, maybe? Let's do it there. So we have a stained glass window there. And they'll have a rug, and then we'll see where we're at with that. Uh, let's see. Now we need to make another bed. Of course, our bird has to make all the fibers textile. So it is doing that. Uh, we say it can up to 20. It needs hollow lily and wormweed. And to make hollow lily, we need to have the graves, I believe. Because that's what provides it. I need a lot more of that. I'm going to say, hey, cut these down. Because I don't think our helpers can actually get to them, maybe? I don't know. Okay, no, that one was just freaking out a little bit. That's fine. We have a lot of rats out here. Okay, you guys are coming out here. Y'all are handling that. Cut down those trees. Uh, we have that kind of built out. We need to get the rug. And is this one worth more? This one's 20. This one's 16. So a huge ornate rug. So we can put that under the bed and everything and have that done. Um, that'll be 20. And I still don't think that's going to be enough. So we're going to have to find a way to get more luxury in here. But we can at least try to get one room today. I don't know if we're going to be able to get a ton. Um, okay, so you can see our harvester's taking care of the, everything. Fertilizer. We may only need one of those at a time. I think one of those would be fine. The harvesters, I think we could do with more. Possibly. Uh, grown. Okay. We might be able to deal with more. Yeah, I think we need one less... I don't think we need as many fertilizers that we have. And then we can have one more. So let's take a look. Fertilizer, let's say... Let's do one. And then let's do... Three harvesters? Let's do three harvesters. I think three harvesters would be good. Because we have a lot of things that we cut down, harvest, etc. Like, I mean, you have all these honey drops. And these guys are doing their job. Uh, the harvester... Oh, well, maybe two is good. No, I think one will be fine. One will be fine. All right, so we have this cut down. Let's go ahead and add our last scarecrow. I know you guys have been pointing out that I need to make these forever, and finally we're doing that. Uh, I'm going to put it here, actually, so we can build out these plots a little bit better. Not much I can do here since I've taken up this with a ground thing, but that's okay. Okay, so we have our scarecrow, which is good. They will no longer eat our crops. Uh, our weaver bird is doing their job. Uh, we're still lacking on smoke sticks, so we've added the smoke sticks. Felicity is building them currently, so I have those built, which would be grand. Okay, how are we doing up here? Nothing is built. That's fine. Uh, research. We still need a lot of scrolls, which we can go to the underschool if we really want to. Um, also, I think we are researching. Where is the... There it is. I think we were actually researching these rugs. Oh, no, I lied. Okay. I, for some reason, I thought I saw some progress in there. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, okay, so they're storing things, which is good. Took a look at our resources up here. I think we're all good on that. Okay, collapse a lot of those. All right, very good. Okay, so what can we do down here? Well, we have this cave and we have this chamber. The stone ruins would be good because I think we are lacking on stone a little bit. Uh, we can go in here and clear that out. Uh, we do have a good amount of professors now that are actually pretty decent, especially Davian. This Davian, Davian the third is quite strong. I mean, he is, he's very good. He just has to stay in the back as a fire user, unfortunately, because if he stays up front, he's going to die immediately with that 40 health. Okay, so Flizzy's building our Scarecrow. That one can't be reached, which makes sense. I probably should have thought about that before I put that there. That's okay. We'll go ahead and cancel the symbol and have those three. We have some wasted space there, but that's all right. 
We can put something out of there for future reference. Uh, we have our carriers going around doing the job, doing their jobs as everyone sleeps, which is amazing. Okay, everyone has a bed, right? We're doing good on that. Thomas is ready to graduate, so I think what we'll do is go ahead and send Thomas off. Thomas was our curse student with a tier two wand, um, but is a fire wand. We have Davian, so I'm going to go ahead and say we're going to graduate Thomas. Uh, so Thomas, actually, we'll wait. We'll wait till we have a couple more students that we can graduate as well. Just do a mass graduation. And then what I'm going to do is, I think I'm going to go down to this stone ruin right there. Once everyone's awake, let them get some sleep. We have some unreachable objects, and I will be right back. Okay, guys, sorry about that. All right, let's see, back to what we were doing. Okay, so Felicity's building that. Uh, we, what is, what is Drake doing? Uh, Drake is not building. Well, granted, we don't have any construction going on because we haven't expanded the school in forever, so Drake doesn't really have much to build. So an air, an air user would be pretty decent at the moment. I know we were trying to replace Lila at some point with a water wand user, but I don't think we found one that we particularly care for. I don't, well, let's see. What, is, what was Uz? Uh, Uz, HP, HP power mana, speed power. Okay, so this could, well, that's Fire Nodge. So I think I was going to wait until we replace Lila. Now, what do we not really need at the moment? Because having seven professors is pretty difficult, um, especially with hiring. So like if we look at the higher staff, if we look at this, we have to have... Oh, no, we're fine. Okay, we could have another professor if we want. So I might have an air professor. Um, having seven might be overkill, but I think it'd be fine. I mean, I've got to build out their housing here, so I have to. I may have to build another quadrant right here up, but I don't know if I have enough room for that. And it might just have to go off this way. And they could still go up and around, but I don't know. I'm, I'm feeling kind of because having having this massive tower, I would really want to have like a teleporter at the top so they can teleport down. Um. But man, I don't know. I feel, I feel like that massive tower can be kind of cool, but also just kind of crazy looking. But anyway, I'm going to worry about that later. We're going to make sure we get all this stuff done. So we have an austere bedroom now. Uh, I'm going to assign this to... Uh, we're going to say Drake. Drake, you now have this wonderful bedroom. So you are assigned to it. That is your bedroom now. So Drake is now... Because I think Drake has been one of our longest uh, professors here. Uh, he's, I think being to the far left i think he's probably the one that's been around the longest so we'll have him in that bed all right so we have the so we have plenty of our ash parchment which means we'll start saving up smoke sticks which means i can possibly get another one in here so let's take a look at that we need some sinew and some smoke sticks so we are going to make some sinew uh we are out of carcasses so we need to go murder some scarecrow uh so we'll hunt you and I'm going to leave these nests here so I can actually hunt them. Now that we have the Scarecrow, they shouldn't be eating my crops, which is good. Uh, we have the rats. Let's go over here and see if we have any Scarecrow. We do have a Crow there. Hunt you. We have a Crow there. Hunt you. Yeah, because I, th I think it's just beneficial to leave them there now. Uh, as long as they don't eat my crops and the Scarecrow's work as intended, then we should be good there. That Mana Lantern is still useless, I know. I just left it there. <laughs> uh, what was I going to look for? Uh, we need... What else do we need for you? Uh, you guys are making... Let's see, we need Viscera. So you guys are making that. So we just need to make sure we have carcasses. Which is good. I wish there was like a... If there was a carcass that's... Or, you know, a scarecrow that spawns. I wish I could just kind of summon it. Uh, brain fell on the ground. Uh, I was going to look here. See if we can push out the fog yet. We can't. We need more smoke stick. Which is fine. We are growing plenty. We have a lot down here. Uh, we have our harvesters taking care of that. Uh, we may not need three now. I'm going to I'm going to cut back on that again. I think I think the way we had it before was good, but I still only think we need one uh what's it called? Uh fertilizer. So, professors enjoying their nice little dance room. The fog is getting closer. I can't wait to have more recreation. I think more recreation is going to be pretty cool. Uh furniture. Mm, we can have another canopy bed so we can assign another professor a private room. So we'll have it like that and then we will get some runners. And then let's go ahead and put us a stained glass window above so that they uh, have some nice lighting. 
And then we want to make sure that we can do the rugs eventually. I'm um, getting the bed so that the professors kind of have a... Ooh, this is not austere anymore. Why is it not austere? Uh, actually, wait. Is austere? No. Bedroom is better. Okay, good. Okay, so... Professors are slowly getting nice bedrooms. We are getting there. Slowly but surely moving people out of here and converting this room. So I'm going to go ahead and disintegrate that. We don't need it anymore. I don't see any reason for us to have it. We have plenty of beds for the students. Um, I eventually want this to be a house commons, but I need to figure out what we need to convert that over. So if we have rec room house commons, it has to be towered, elevated, and private. So we're going to have to probably send a spiral staircase. Well, not even that. It just has to be towered, which, you know, for towered... No adjacent rooms left, right, or above. Uh, yeah, I mean, we can send a spiral staircase into it, so we can, like, send it and have the house commons just up here. Um, it could be elevated. We can literally have this go up, have this as, like, a cap, and it's just, like, a... This can be, like, a floating tower. We can cut this off, get rid of the entire thing here, and just have this entire house commons right there. I think that's going to be a good thing to do. And then we can possibly... Ooh, actually, wait a minute. Could I do this? Is this a thing I could do? Uh, maybe. Maybe. I'm gonna try something real quick. I'm gonna just see if this works. I think I did this in the last episode, so you're probably like, hey, you already tried this, it's not gonna work. Oh no, it could work. I'm gonna do that. So this is gonna be another way for them to get to the, uh, the magical beasts so that they can take care of them. Um, I'm gonna move this uh, around. I'm gonna have this probably right against this wall, and I'm gonna move the boar against this so they have more room here. But that way, they don't have to go all the way down, up, and around. There's gonna be multiple ways for the students. So if you know they're down here, when they wake up, they can go and take care of the beast by going down the spiral staircase and going up the stairs there. There's no reason for us to like have this room here, but because we have that there, the students can now just go up through here <clears throat> and easily access the the magical beast. Um, I'm going to keep this staircase here just for the sake of it. Um, just in case they would come from this direction go up. But it's a little wonky, but hey, it's a magic school. It's supposed to be wonky. All right, so we have another austere bedroom. Once this window gets built, um, we'll have a better bedroom. And the next one I'm going to put is Jackson in here. Jackson, congratulations. You actually have a nice bedroom now. All right, so Jackson now has his bedroom. Jackson, I don't know what color you want your bedroom to be, but it's going to turn into the austere bedroom, so you're not going to be able to do that. So that's okay. Alrighty, so another bed down. Rinse wind, uh, grand staff. Uh, this is no one, so we're gonna disintegrate that. This is now just a standard dormitory. So I think what I'm gonna do is try to get these. To oh, look at that! I didn't even notice the lighting on the uh, on the uh, stained glass windows. That's a really nice effect. I also like how we basically have this area where it hits. That's a really good lighting effect there. I really like that. But yeah, it basically the light just smacks the uh, the bed. But hey, I don't know if you want that hitting you that early in the morning. I could move these down, but I don't know. I kind of like them being up there. I think it's fine as it is. Uh, once again, we're going to try to make another one. Uh, we are out of rune wood. So we need to get the rune wood trees, or we're not going to have any more uh, beds for our professors. We're going to need to push the fog back. Can we do that yet? Uh, I want to do a superior, so we need to get some ice petals and smoke sticks, so I will save it for that. How's our bird doing? Uh, we're out of hollow lily, and to get hollow lily, we need to make sure we have our graves. Um, so, to make that... Okay, so hollow lily is actually kind of important. How can we make hollow lily? Is that... Was that a... Also, we have no resource selected. Uh, we completed that very large research. Is there anything else we could do, or do we need... No, we could do this getting, um, po really posh. Uh, we'll get pseudo armor and a, a bigger glass window, which we'll do. So I could have swore there was a research we could do that would help us hollow lily, and some of you guys were like, ah, it's not really worth it. Um, but I do need some hollow lily. Wandering Mage's Grave, a place to buy characters, uh, to bury characters' corpse, will spawn a spirit that will scout the fog and bring back smoke pearls. Ah, okay, so that's the smoke pearls, which we, that's what you guys were saying, the smoke pearls, like, uh, yeah, you don't really need them. So we just need more graves, unfortunately. There's not much we can do about this besides harvest it. I think I'll make this a five. 
uh, for when the har like just harvest it. I mean, that's a quick thing, easy thing that the harvesters can come do. Uh, we're gonna clean up some of this. And we have this crow corpse. Okay, so once we get our ice petals, we'll push the fog back. We now have our second austere bedroom, our regular bedroom. So that is very good. I don't austere almost makes me think it should be better. I don't. I honestly don't know the true meaning of austere. I probably should look that up. Um, but yeah. Okay, so construction. Uh, we're gonna have a secondary floor here. So this floor is going to go. Did I build this right? Okay, so we need to have this go up one or two more, I think. So I need the spiral staircase to go up. And that'll probably be where we need the floor to go. The floor has to be right above... Right above the... Um, the roof of the room. Which part of me... I, I know it's kind of silly to say this, but part of me is really excited to... Try and make these again. Um, I'm actually going to expand these out to make these look a little bit better. So when the game has a full 1.0 release, I'm kind of, I'm actually kind of excited to do do a uh, a replay of it, uh, just so that you know I can take what I've learned and apply it to a new school. Uh, but I probably won't do that till a major major patch or 1.0. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we have seven. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I know this is not fair to the professors down here, but we might as well have the room. I'm gonna. The the, the school is going. Uh, it's kind of getting wider as it gets taller, which doesn't make any sense from a structural perspective. But hey, it's fine. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and build out these walls as well. Um, I'm gonna have this wall go up because we need the floor there. So that wall goes there, that wall goes there, and then they will build that out. Very good, all right, so we're working on that. Uh, Drake will probably get a lot of that construction done. And this is where this is where the teleporters would come in handy because I mean, this is really far from way down here. Uh, it's kind of silly looking, but hey, that's fine. All right, can I make this other? No, I can't. We're missing the rune wood, right? Uh, so we'll need to push the fog back. Uh, can we do a superior? Not yet, we're getting there. Um, we have our ice petals. I'm, honestly, I may need to make another wood cuttery. We do need to eventually replace those trees at some point. Um, I think when our professors wake up, we need to make sure they eat, so let's get our schedule. And I think you guys said I messed up our schedule. So, yeah, yes, did I mess up their schedule? Uh, I don't think I messed up the schedule. Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, yeah, you guys are right. Yeah, look at that. Okay, all students. All right, so I did flip the, uh, flop the schedules. So, this needs to be two recreation. This needs to be eating. This needs to be... Oh, geez, I already forgot. What did I just have that as? Uh, there was two of that. And then when did I have my professor eating for... I think I only had one eating. And then I had two recreation here, and then eating again for the students. Actually, I think I only had eating here. I think that's the way I did it. Yeah, I had just regular recreation for the staff. Okay, I think that's right. I think. But yeah, okay, you guys are right on that. Thank you for the heads up on that. I, I, was, I was sitting here, I was like, I, I remember you guys commenting on something else, and I don't exactly remember what it was, but hey, I'll eventually remember it. All right, so how are we doing on building? Uh, we can't make any more of these because we're out of runewood, so we definitely need to get those runewood trees up. Uh, we are almost to, uh, we almost have the ability to do a superior rep repel fog, which I'm hoping we'll find some of those trap vines so we can build out some of the other things that I want to do there. We have plenty of other room to build our classrooms eventually, and a lot of that's going to come with the uh, next updates that we do for this game. School has gotten pretty big. I'm really hoping the next update includes something for the Magic Beast. I want to turn this into a massive Magic Beast room some way or another. 
Okay. Still not there yet. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down here. We're going to fight. We're going to do a fight. I'm going to take Jackson out. I'm going to put Davy in him. And then Lila. I think I'm going to take Lila out. And then I'm going to do... Who am I going to select? Not Yahara. Yahara? Yahara. Uh, Ritzwind? No. Well... I just realized Jax only has 15 health. Wow, I'm gonna try Rinse one and see what happens. Also, excuse me, I'm having some, having some uh, indigestion, unfortunately. Uh, nature. Mm, I think we'll try this, we'll try this setup. We're gonna bring Dragon Flash just in case. We need to make more of those. Let's bring Recharging just in case. Let's bring Revivals just in case. And let's do Rejuvenations just in case. Just in case. And I actually need to go to our potion desk and see what potions we can make. So while they while they get down there, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, revive. Uh, let's add a dragon fire. Let's, yeah, let's do that. So what do we need? We need hollow lilies. Oh, more hollow lily. Uh, let's do until we have four of them uh, to take with us. We just need to make sure we have, uh, I don't think there's an easier way to get hollow lily. I could be wrong. Let's check here. Let's look at hollow lily. After this fight. <laughs> all right, what do we got? So we have, ooh, all right, we have two bats. Uh, Drake already got attacked, which is unfortunate, but so we're just gonna throw his earth armor on. That's okay. Miasma attacks all enemies, total damage. Uh, sure, yeah, we'll do that. Sounds like a good idea. That's kind of what they just did. Uh, Flame Lash, we can do a ton of damage to one enemy. We could go ahead and finish off this Might if we really wanted to, but I think I might go ahead and do a ton of damage to you. Take you out, 132, that's awesome. Vine Lash, um, I'm gonna throw a growth on you so you take damage over time. I need to take out that Might as soon as possible. Drake's armor, once again, proving indestructible. We're gonna throw armor on him again. Okay, so we can do Shadow Cloak, or we can do Miasma again and do another 20. Base damage, power modifier. Let's yeah, let's just go and keep hitting them with Miasmo. I know that's probably not the best, but it's go whittling them down, all of them. Fireball. Um, we can do another flame lash and take this one out, or we can take this might out. I'm gonna take this might out. Granted, I probably should be saving my uh, mana on Davian for taking this uh, back one out, but I think we'll be fine. Uh, I'm gonna throw a growth on. Ooh, can't, can't hit you yet for some reason. Not sure why. Um, okay, let's do Surging Strength and let's put that on uh, the guys in the back because they are doing a lot of our damage. That's fine, Drake's taking damage. No problem for him. Uh, we have 40 here. Uh, I think we're gonna be good on our armor, so I'm gonna go ahead and do some attacks. Uh, Miasma 40, yep, let's hit that. That kills that one, now we have this one left. And we just Flame Lash to do a bunch of damage. 77. Growth on you, take damage over time. Okay, hit Grand Staff, that's fine. Grand Staff is good. Uh, 40, yep, we'll do that. Because the rest of our professors should be able to take it out. It's gonna do 30, 18, and then Flame Lash to finish it off. Very good, not, not too bad of a fight. I think definitely working towards metals helps a lot. We have a Lightning 1, 2, 7 Arcane Scrolls, some wood, and Phoenix Flowers. And we have some stone in here, which our harvesters will come get. Uh, we do have a underground chamber here that we have to push back every once in a while. We got some scrolls, not a lot. I really want to get to the point where we can make these, which we need that thorn tooth. Uh, thorn tooth, thorn tooth. Is there a way I can see that and hover over it? Uh, thorn tooths. Yeah, so we need trap door vines. Uh, Plant in traps and consumes many creatures won't eat shattered. Harvest thorn tooth, trap door, vine seed. Okay, so we need to get a thorn tooth so we can get it seed. I need medical rest. Uh, we got some trials completed. Uh, Wallace got their trials good. Need medical rest, battle weights. All right, cool. So that's done. Let's go ahead and harvest these. There's a lot of those. We can push back the fog most likely, so let's go ahead and do that. Do a superior repel fog. 
Let's grab our most experienced professors. So we'll have Davian with his fire one, two. That's 80 repel. 80 repel. Let's see what Drake can do. 80 repel. That's fine. Eight. Okay, I think all of you are going to be 80. Yep, 80 repel. So let's do that. It's going to take two hours to do that ritual, which is fine. Uh, some of you need some bed rest. And I'm hoping that this pushback will get us some trap door vines so we can actually work towards getting um, our arcane scrolls bolt out. Because we desperately need those. Okay, what are our what are our students doing? What are you where are you guys going? Where are you where are you guys going? I guess I guess you're gonna go gather something. Okay, let's see how far this pushes back. Because we have what five professors working on this. I mean, look at look at how much that drained it too. Oh yeah, that's pushing it back a ton. You can see how clear the crystal's getting there. Alrighty, let's see what we got here. Whoa, man, you guys sent it way back. Look at that. That's an unstable an enemy. Uh, there's a trap. Oh wait, actually, wait a minute. Is that you? Yeah, there we go. We want to hunt that guy. So harvest that. Um, I'm hoping that doesn't kill anything. I don't know necessarily how those work. Uh, that's is that a what's that? Is that a trap door line? Kind of looks like it. Uh, we're gonna harvest some rune wood, so let's go ahead and harvest as much as that as that of that as we can. I'm speaking way too fast again. Uh, chop, yep, and chop all that down. Uh, okay, let's go check our other side. I don't see any more trap door vines. Granted, it's fractal modes. We don't need any of those yet. Not that I'm aware of. Is that a rune wood tree? No, there it is. The trap door vine. Okay, hang on. Harvest you. Okay, so I'm assuming if you get near it, it hurts you. I don't know how that's gonna work. I'm gonna go ahead and let the um, let those guys do it. And and this is another thing where um, teleporters are coming handy because going from side to side on the map, a little rough. And I think I talked about this in one of my previous episodes, having them where they don't get affected by the fog, but you can use them after the fog has been pushed back, would be a godsend. Because for our students and or for our um, our professors and our helpers to get out here. It is a journey to get them out here. Another trapdoor vine. Harvest that guy. All right, harvest this guy right there. I'm gonna harvest you. Harvest the trapdoor vine. Uh, do we see any more on the ground? They kind of hide. I don't see them. And I didn't even bother to check, but I may have been able to. Uh, make rune wood. I think there's actually a way that sculpt stone stone. Do you ever produce rune wood? No, you don't. Okay, I thought there was one of these that produces rune wood. You do. Okay, so wood and wormweed. Oh, okay, here we go. We can actually tell it to do this. Well, that's kind of silly, isn't it? Um, I'm not gonna do infinite, but I'm gonna do until we have 150. I think is a safe bet. I think we'll do that, which would not be bad. All right, so we now have our rune wood. So a couple different things. Do we have our trapdoor vines? We do. Okay, so we're getting that. So arcane scrolls will be made, and I do want to see. We can't plant them yet because we don't have the research for it. So we need to get the research for that. Um, I do want to check open research. Is that a thing that's in the game yet? Do we have trapdoor vine planters? Terrarium as a luxury, and that's a okay. Trapdoor vine planter. There it is. You need 96 arcane scrolls. Wow. Okay, that's a lot, but that's okay. Also, I feel like there's some new things I haven't seen in here before. Let's, let's check that out. Let's see. I don't remember seeing this statue here. I don't remember seeing these. Could be crazy. But we can now make these. We have the scriv uh, the scrivener. So we can actually start making these arcane scrolls and use the trapdoor vines that we found. And we'll store the seeds and we'll have those available to us. Uh, am I actually storing the seeds anywhere? Let's see. Uh, I could have this tiny chest. I could say, you know, seeds go in here, but it only can store certain things. Um, I really probably need to put a chest in here that's four seeds. So let's go ahead and say build. And I would really love to get a large chest in here, but I'm going to have to replace it eventually because we just don't have the access to large chest yet. 
I'm gonna say, hey, build that as soon as you can, because I'd like to get it assigned, so we are planting our seeds somewhere. We have our rune wood coming out, which is good. Uh, contents, this is still good for materials. We can store anything in there. Okay. They'll build that eventually, so they're putting the materials that we need in there. We have plenty of battles here. We could get some good materials out of these, I think. I'm gonna say, hey, mine these if you can. Uh, what level is this? That is a four. Okay, yeah, we're not really ready for that yet. Uh, so I'm gonna mine these. I'm gonna collect some of this as well. I'm just gonna go ahead and kind of put jobs to get a lot of this, these materials out here because we can definitely use them. Uh, we have this crystal, clouded crystal, grab that. Uh, grab you, gloomy crystal. I'm assuming this is a battle since it didn't hi highlight before. That's a misty crystal, so we grab that too. Very good. Uh, we have a crow here. Let's go ahead and hunt that because we need the corpses. Because I'm pretty sure we are out of corpses. No, not really. Got more rats. So many rats. Wow, that is a ton of rats. I think we can use the rats' corpses as well. Maybe. Uh, go ahead and select you. Hunt you. Very good. Okay, how are we looking? We got some rune wood. We have a trapdoor vine seed. We have the thorn teeth. We have another trapdoor vine. Let's go ahead and hit you. Grab you before the fog decides to uh, uh, rescind. Uh, go and grab that. Harvest you. All right, trapdoors. Very good. All right. So let's go all the way back to the school. And let's see here. How is this looking in terms of luxury? What is our room looking like here? So we have, tw oh, we're not even close. Oh, we need 60 luxury for this. Okay. Um, so we need 60. We're at, what, 20 something? So we need a good chunk, um, which means we're going to have to rely, having the normal bedrooms is fine. We're going to need to rely on getting some more decorations uh, down the tech tree line in order to fill these out. Them being bedrooms right now is perfectly fine. I don't need to think too much into it. So uh, we're fine getting those bedrooms set up. All right, so you're producing all three of these, which is good. Our bird is busy. We're going to say this chest is, oh my goodness, there it is started. That one's just for seeds. All right, clear all. Seeds only. And then we should be only putting the corpses in here. I don't know. Yeah, hang on. We want non-mage corpses. We want quilted corpses. So let's go ahead and get all the quilted ones in here. And that should be good. So they'll store those in there. And if we need to, we'll put another chest so that uh, we can have just a chest full of the corpses and one just full of the ingredients. But for now, I think that's fine. Okay, so we have our Earth Teaching going. Uh, I don't think we have any other teaching that we can set up. No, we still only have the Earth Teaching slabs, which is fine. Jackson is still doing that. I don't think we have any... One, tier 3 ones yet. I could be wrong, but I don't think we do. No, we're still on Tier 2. That's perfectly fine. Our crystal is looking very good. Uh, let's see what else we got here. Okay, we've got our smoke sticks. Our harvesters are doing their job. We have all of this that needs to be moved around. Probably should have another chest for shrinks at some point. Uh, why did we have a potion of recharging in here? Is there a reason I had that in here? Was that my... Ice petals of ectoplasm. And they're flat. I don't know why this is in here. I don't know why we have the rejuvenation. Is there a reason that we have rejuvenation potions? Uh, Viscera, no, no, no. Why did I have Rejuvenation Potion in here? No, not that, no, not that. Nope. Did you need it for something? No, you did not. I do not know why that potion's in there, so I'm gonna say, hey, don't do that. <laughs> so let's go ahead and throw out this potion. I'm gonna say no to that. I probably need to work on some of this organization here, because for you to make a rune wood, you need wormweed. Do we have wormweed storing in here at all? Stone, wood, sinew, ice petals, wormweeds, we do. Okay, good. So I think this is good right now. We're going to leave that as is. Um, 
Okay, uh, things are starting to flow better. Uh, we have our um, our repair uh, cultist helper going. Ooh, okay, here we go. We have a torch snuffer. We can go get take a review. Get our professors on the job. I don't think that's gonna give us any arcane scrolls. I could be wrong. And I don't know if the handicap or the handyman quilted helper can reach these. He might be able to. Uh, all right, someone's stuck. I want to make sure that we're not having that mana lantern loop. No, we're not. Okay, good. Okay, let's throw on some earth armor to ja uh, Drake. And then let's see tentacle lash, miasma. Uh, let's go ahead and do a shadow cloak, and then do a bunch of damage. We'll put that on rinse wind, and then we'll have that buff for the next turn. Drake taking that damage is perfectly fine. Uh, flame lash. Let's go ahead and do just do a bunch of initial damage. Uh, I think I might just do vine lash. Uh, I wish I could put it on you, but actually, I'm gonna put it on surging strength and get these guys buffed up. I think that'd be good. And then, yeah, it's on Earth Armor again, so Drake doesn't lose his health. He didn't want to recover out of this fight. Uh, Tentacle Ash, we can go ahead and finish off you. Good 90 jam damage. Yep, Drake taking that damage is fine. Flame Lash, 102. And then we'll have Rincewind do Growth. Or sorry, Grand Staff, not Rincewind. And then we can have Drake finish the job. Very good. So we got some ectoplasm, some arcane scrolls, and some hollow lily. I think hollow lily can come from. It's not just the graves. Look at all these rats. We need something that can hunt. I think there might be a cultural helper that can hunt. I could be wrong. Uh, can I make any more bedrooms? Uh, no. We are still out of fibrous textile and rune wood. We are making rune wood though and gathering it. Uh, of course, I think we've gathered all the room we can. Oh, no, you're, you're still chopping at some. Oh, no, we've got plenty of trees out here. Where's our... Uh, do we not have a... Um, woodcutter? Uh, quilted... Oh, maybe we haven't researched them yet. Hang on, let's see if we've researched them. Open research. No, we have. We just haven't made any yet. All right, cool. Let's get these set up. Uh, so, quilting order, we want a... Where are you guys at? Lumberjack. Let's do... Let's do two Lumberjacks, I think, would be good. We'll do... Where you at? Lumberjack. Lumberjack. Where's my Lumberjack? Let's do until two. And then we'll add a recycled quilted Lumberjack, and we'll just do infinitely. Uh, so let's provide those. And then Miner. Um, I'm actually gonna... We'll do one Miner, I think. I'll do, do until one... And then we will do a quilted miner recycled and then say do infinite because I don't think we're going to need that many miners, especially if, you know, Drake doesn't have anything to build and then he can just go mine easily. Uh, you guys cannot reach this area, which is understandable as I did not put a door there. So let's do that. Actually, you can't just you can't seem to reach this area at all. Is it because? Oh, I haven't finished making the um, staircase here. So let's build that up one more. There we go. This is gonna look, I think this is gonna look fine. It's gonna make it look a little more um, magic school esque. Uh, we can also ooh, I should have made a better mages study. Yeah, we should have made a. This is a. St oh wow, yeah, we were behind on this. We can we could probably go ahead and make the hermitage. We need a large bookshelf. Do we have a large bookshelf? We do have a large bookshelf. Yeah, we can go ahead and make this if we really wanted to, and I think that would help our research. Uh, Mage's Hermitage. So it has to be lofted, elevated, skewed, and isolated. No path to another room. So how can I do this? It has to be elevated... It has to okay, hang on, wait a minute. It has to be elevated, lofted, skewed, and isolated. No path to another room. 
So it has to be connected from like an outside area, which almost makes me think I need to have a room. So, how could I do this? Because we can't have it, we can't just have a roof over. This is almost where you need a, a teleporter would be nice, but I know there's a way I can do it. I'm trying to think in my head what the best way is. Because it can't be attached to another room. What we could do is have... Could just focus on the tower right now. Um... No path to any other room. So what I could do... Because the floors are technically pathways. You could have a foundation. We could have... A, it would have to be a separate room almost. And, you know, we could have a uh, elevated... Yeah, I have, a, I have an idea of what I want to do for this, but it's going to be a little... It's not complex, but... um, I should have saved some room left and right uh, on our school here. And so what I think I'm going to have to do is... Have a door and then a stair... Is that a thing I can do? Can I do this? Okay, so we can go down, but we can't go up. So can I do this? Is that, hang on, wait, 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 wait. I would like to go... So I have a door. Honestly, take out this room, put a roof above this one. I don't have to rebuild this entire thing. Because we're going to use this as our support. And it's going to be off here to the side. So my thought process is to take out this room. And may honestly take out this room. Just get rid of these two rooms in general. And have a roof right here. Once he finishes that research, I think we'll do that. Uh, because we won't be doing any research for a while until we get our... Um, until we get a lot of this set up. So I'm going to have to move these this chest around. I'm going to have to move a lot of these and shrink them. Actually, we don't really need this right now. So I'm going to go ahead and... I'm going to pause this. Uh, let's see. Let's pause. Uh, what was... The, what were they working on? They're working... Yeah. So we don't really need... We're going to pause that for a second. And I'm going to shrink these. So we're going to shrink... Shrink. Shrink. We're going to move this. I'm not sure how shrinking works with this. So I'm going to move that there. And then... Uh, no, ooh, not disintegrate. Shrink that. And shrink that. So we're going to work on that. And then I'm going to destroy this room... Okay, they're going to have to put that back, back, all that back in there. That's fine. Uh, once we have that shrunk, I will destroy all of this and then move it. So, let's see. I'm going to go ahead and disintegrate these. I'm going to have nicer windows. Um, does this room require any special luxury? I don't think it does. No, it doesn't. Okay, cool. Oh, we need a bell tower. Oh... No. I don't think I have a bell tower, do I? Oh, I do have a bell tower. We just need ignium. Okay, hang on. We can do that. Let's get this. Let's get this pig working. Um, actually, you don't make ignium, do you? Uh, we need to make ignium. Ignium. We need an enemy cells. Okay, we can do that. I think. How much? How, okay. How much of this do we need? I need to make this bell tower. Uh, bell tower. We need 60 and we need 125 sculpt zone. You need to get to work. Uh, let's go ahead and knock this up a little bit. Let's just say 150 sculpt stone. You get to work on that. You're going to need to work on the ignium. Um, we're going to do until we have 60 because that's what I need. I'm actually going to change that and do until 60. So what we need is the anemone cells. And I believe the anemone cells come from the masses that we saw here that I didn't know what to do with before. Look at our miner getting to work. Look at them go. Yeah, so this unstable anemone. So let's grab all of those that we can. Harvest them. 
And I'm going to put a five on that because I want those actually done pretty quickly. I'm going to say harvest those two. So we'll have the harvest the trapdoor vines. Um, cause we want all of that. Uh, we'll make that. Okay, cool. I don't think that's 60, so I'm gonna go over oh, to this side and see if we can get any more. We're not gonna need research for a second, but that's fine. We're not making any scrolls or any of that, but, you know, we're getting towards a better, um... There's a lot of runewood out here, too. Lots to do in Harvest. I don't think we have any anemone cells out here, unfortunately. No, it doesn't look like it. So hopefully that's gonna be enough. If not, ooh, wait, no, here we go. That's one, harvest that. I'm hoping that's gonna be enough to make the igname that we need, because what is it, one per? It's two, okay, so two. Um, oh, we need a lot of thorn tooths too. We need a lot of thorn tooths and we need a lot of igname. Oh, we, this is, so the igname that we're gonna need to grow and I might not be able to make this what I want it to be later. Which is unfortunate. Yeah, I just don't think we're gonna be able to get all that that we need to make the Igneum. And we might be able to harvest some when we get further down, but we're not there yet. So I think, ooh, man, we have a lot of people that can graduate. So I think what's, best, what's gonna be best is for us to just go ahead and upgrade to the, um, the tower at least. So we can get, uh, it just needs to be private and towered. Um, so the towered keyword was no, oh, of course, and then we have this one right here. Oh, I hate the towered keyword. All right. So honestly, we could probably go ahead and do my plan here. So what we can do is leave this door here, I think. Right, leave that door there. No, because we're going to build off this and go that way. Uh, well, let's see, because we're going to build the door out that way, and then I was going to build this way. Yeah, so... I want to move these beds. I'm going to move that here, because the roof is going to go this way. And I'm going to destroy you. So let's demolish this. And then we're going to destroy... All of this. I'm gonna leave this here because this is gonna be like our access point. Um, and I'm gonna destroy this floor as well. So we're gonna do that for right now until I can figure out what I wanna do here. Have a massive dormitory now. Also, I find it funny you guys can destroy things from really far away, but you can't construct things. That's, I don't know, that's hilarious to me. All right, so we need to just demolish this a little bit and then we'll kind of fix this roof here. Uh, this roof is giving me a little funky, but that's okay. Build, we want construct. And then we want to do... Ooh, roof, all right. I want that to go there, and then I want to bring this down as much as I can. Can I flatten it a little bit more? Uh, no, that's not really going to work, is it? I'm going to have to make that go up a little bit more if I want it to, or just completely get, get rid of this room. Uh, granted, our professors are sleeping here right now. Uh, probably need to bring this forward and work on that. Uh, I could move these up here right now. I know that not everyone has a bedroom. Uh, this also has no support on the walls. Uh, why is that not? Is it because I made it go out too far? I guess I made it go, go out too far. Yeah. So I'll have to replace this and put a wall there. Um, so we'll cancel it. Because I, I can go ahead and put professors in bedrooms up here. So we'll do that. We'll build. Put the wall up. Put that there. Put that there. Because I think they're both the same height there. Uh, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. So it should be six because... I know that goes, that's got to go there. There we go. All right, cool. Uh, I'm not sure why I'm not getting support out of that. We've built it the same exact way unless we're finally just hitting our support limit up here, which is very possible. 
Until this floor gets replaced, maybe. I don't know. We'll see what happens there. Okay. Um, so beds are getting moved. Uh, and just for the meantime, I'm going to move professors kind of like this. It's not ideal, but it'll work. So I have two like that. That's moved, that's moved, and that's moved. Very right, good. So we're moving those. Um, we'll shrink this for right now. We'll disintegrate these. And I think I'm just going to get rid of this, this room here. And then have this be a roof. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this room yet. We may make it a better auditorium eventually and move these beds out of the way. But I know for sure that we are kind of getting rid of this. So let's demolish this. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go do a lot of what I'm planning here, and then I'll come and show you guys what I have got gotten done. Okay, guys, I am back, and that took a little bit longer than I thought it would, but I have finally made this major tower here. You can see it has the nice, beautiful starry wallpaper. And I try to make the isolated keyword work, but this does not do it. Uh, so what I'm understanding is, I think you guys mentioned this in an earlier video, but the isolated keyword is not in the game yet because there's no really physical possible way to do it. And that's the reason why I finally built this, but after looking at the room, it doesn't have the isolated keyword. So I think there's a certain thing that we, ooh, what was that? Okay, Thunderstorm Rages. And we don't have any of the, um, <laughs> we don't have any of the uh, lightning rods either. But anyway, yeah, so that's the, uh, that's the deal here. So we do have, oh, okay. Something got struck and something got destroyed. Excellent, so hopefully we'll repair that at some point. Uh, but yeah, so that's the uh, what's going on here. Um, we've rebuilt this out. I'm going to have to add the orders back to make Arcane Scrolls and Adept Scrolls, which is fine. Um, I'm just going to say do infinite. But yeah, we have the Mage's Tower now at least, so that our research is going to be much quicker. Uh, an extra 100% quicker to be exact. Um, I did kind of reorganize some of this right here. You can kind of see it. It's not daytime, so, you know, it's kind of hard to see. But, hey, that's what we've done. Um, we made two total Ignium for the Bell Tower, which, you know, we can't have any uh, right now anyway, which is fine. Uh, you you guys get everything fixed for the uh, little lightning storm that we're having. But, yeah, that's kind of the deal with that. Um, there's still some things they need to add to the game. Uh... And then once we have those added, and also these are austere bedrooms, so our professors are still sleeping good. So no worries there. Um, but yeah, that is that is kind of where we're at at the moment. Um, kind of in the next episode when we... I will probably wait until we have a uh, another major update, or uh, depending on what the update is, I'll do some more episodes on it. But I think that's what I'm going to cover for right now, so you guys can expect more in the future. Just keep an eye out uh, for when they do updates to the game, and I will most likely be releasing a video about it. So we've completed our major style. We'll have more research to do. We've used one of these awesome uh, levitation. Uh, what are they called again? They're called. What are you called? The magic supports. So we have those going and starting to use those. So the school is looking pretty good, except for when, you know, all the lightning strikes that just happened. But I'm hoping next time we'll see a, um, a room dedicated to the beasts and maybe something that lets us get the isolated keyword so we can convert this tower into a uh, hermitage so that's gonna be it, guys i hope you guys enjoyed this episode as always we have a bunch of students next time that'll be graduating but uh yeah hope you guys have a good one thank you for watching as always have a great rest of your day wherever you be and i will see you in the next video bye everybody